Hello, everyone. Uh, Hannah is asleep. It's just me today. Uh, she uh, deserves all the rest in the world. She's a little tired. We film these things mad early in the morning. So uh, she sends her love. Sorry, I'm a bit tired this morning, too. She sends her love. Um, episode 3, Season 3, Mandalorian. Let's do it. <laughs> Dad, I threw up. <laughs> Did you see anything alive? Alive? Like what? Nothing. Let's get out of here. <sighs> Just tell him. There's a big ass mythosaur down there. This is the way. <laughs> this is the way. Did he just try to say this is the way? Let's go. Are you still up for the transfer? I don't see any other choice. <laughs> I'm out. Oh, hell yeah. Oh shit, homie. All right. Ho ho ho. Sick. Oh. Right through him. Oh. oh! Oh, that was sick as fuck! <laughs> oh no. No! Oh, Bogotan's gonna be pissed off. <laughs> they bombed the hallway that I sit in all day long. <laughs> Yeah, you done pissed her off, guys. Uh oh. Jesus Christ, there's so many of them. <laughs> Guy can't catch a break. Oh! Coruscant! How about that? The scientist. I like that this episode's like taking its time and it's feeling really lived in. Oh. Well, that's nice. For some reason, like, that transition in the music uh, reminded me of fucking Mario Kart. I can't explain it. <laughs> you want to touch it? Are we allowed to? Allowed? Are they playing March of the Resistance in the background? Is that, like, a fun, playful version of that song? Our main objective is to help the Republic, right? Correct. And that supersedes everything else? It does. Oh, uh, man. I'm nervous. This is a really good episode. I, I like this little side story. The interrogations with the droid, it reminds me of uh, Blade Runner 2049 when Ryan Gosling would go, like, have to sit in that room. On the Blade Runner vibes, his jacket's very Rick Deckard. Where do you think I got the biscuits? I like their friendship a lot. Oh. Star Destroyer. Ugh, what beautiful art direction. Uh, I'm nervous. What about you? What did you want to be when you grew up? 
Her lighting stepping into the shadow there was yeah. ominous. Just the ship settling. Keep talking. I'll keep watch just in case. I don't think it's just the ship settling. <laughs> Shit. Yo. Yo. Now we're doing clockwork orange. Oh shit. Showing the dark sides of the New Republic. Pun intended. No! Damn, she's cold. Ah, yep, that's what you saw down there. She doesn't know how to feel. Oh, Lee Isaac Chung directed that. Nice. I really like that side story with... With the scientist? Um, part of me wishes that it was split up over the past two episodes, and the storylines were kind of coming together that way, but I enjoyed it. Um, really interesting look at Coruscant, interesting look at, especially during this time frame, post-Return of the Jedi. I'm curious as to what's going to go on with Bo-Katan and uh, Din Djarin. I wonder if, if any resentment will grow between the two, especially with Bo-Katan kind of being invited back to church and she doesn't really know if she wants to be there. Either way, it was really interesting. I'm excited for next week. Thank you guys so much for watching, and we'll see you next time.